breaking news, in less than 24 hours, Ukrainian airspace will be closed entirely to civil aircraft. Data on this issue are provided by the publication Strana. The reason for this is not only the risks of large-scale conflict in Ukraine but also the fact that British insurance companies sent letters to air carriers announcing that, from Monday, February 14, 2022, they ceased to operate insurance coverage in Ukraine and above Ukraine for any aircraft. Among other things, foreign carriers had already begun to refuse flights to both Ukraine and the airspace of this country especially the night before it became known that KLM became the first such carrier, however, taking into account unofficial data, another 12 foreign flight carriers are considering refusing to fly to Ukrainian airspace. Officially, Ukraine is not closing its airspace, however, flights over Ukraine will be stopped entirely at the airline's initiative and under pressure from some foreign companies. Kiev has not yet commented on the current situation. However, it is expected that air traffic over Ukraine will stop completely already in the middle of the next day. This action is probably why its citizens, Russia and Belarus, are not allowed to enter the territory of Ukraine, something that became known two days ago. Blog writer opinion for next World War III. Ukrainian airspace will be closed to prevent another civilian airplane downing. All other hybrid operations generally continue on both sides. The mercenaries are ready for provocations and bloodshed, that's why they are there, this is their job, and they are paid for it. And the West has sent its own but also Russia. As soon as the war starts, we will also see a lot of cyber warfare activity and UAV use by Russia. But I continue to insist that Russia will not roll all its dice in the region of eastern Ukraine, as it is an obvious trap. Ukraine is just what looks as the tip of the iceberg. The vast expanse of Russia that stretches from the Baltic and the North Atlantic to Alaska and the Northern Pacific Ocean makes it a first-class bear that in these vast areas can move and move wherever and however it wants. The great camps of World War III begin to form. The war will be sudden and on different fronts in very different lengths and breadths of the earth. With what is happening, even nature itself will revolutionize with enormous volcanoes erupting and powerful earthquakes. The earth bored us with our behavior and our indifference. On the one hand, the sea countries with leaders who speak English. And on the other hand Russia with the countries of the Russian Federation and a strange formal friendship alliance with China, the nations of Middle Earth. A China that will betray Russia in the event of World War III, as it did with the United States after World War II. Does the planet want a new world without Russia? Would the planet withstand its self-destruction? In the end, what we are living is nothing more than an outstanding orchestrated performance of the world elite that wants to take us to the next stage. The questions will be answered quickly and automatically by the events that will unfold before our eyes. Please read more in the link below. Please pray for world peace. If you like the video, and want to contribute financially to my effort, you could make a small contribution, by clicking, on the link below.